have enough cautions. We don't need any more. Patrick, how's that ice cream truck doing out there? After that wheel fell off. They seem to be doing better. What position? Uh, where are they? Uh, <laughs> we're doing great. Some of the cars. Rocket Pop, 22nd place. Way back in 22nd, huh? They got 35 laps in. We're getting a lot of questions about some of the battery chemistry is allowed, Patrick. And that is a very good question. That is, would we allow uh, lead acids as well as uh, uh, lithium ion phosphates? Uh, no lithium polymers. Yeah, no, we ban lithium polymers. Yeah, they have a tendency to explode if you hit them hard. And sometimes we got hard hits here. But my clothes are good. We got a caution. In the back, it looks like. Oh, no, lawful cart. Yeah. We're good. Big caution, it's the leader. Oh, the no. leader is wrecked. The leader is tipped over. That's Fubo right there. Unbelievable, the leader is wrecked. Huge wreck. <laughs> we got that on camera. The lead lap car of Fubar. More benefits to catastrophe. Fubar looks to be okay. The driver. <laughs> yeah, good. Patrick got a message. Patrick got a message. She says she's fine. Patrick. She's good. We got a little message for the picture on that. What happened out there as a driver? Well, that's, that's what helped her win two races before. Well, that's, that's good to know as well. She has two wins under her belt right now. A Hasn't hurt anyone here. Back to you, Patrick. Holy smokes out there. It's Cartastrophe still for holding on. Fubar flipping over, not helping now. Still a lap down. Lightning McQueen farther down, but it's a tight race for uh, fourth, fifth. Uh, all on the same lap there. Are you greasy, unfortunately, falling behind a bit. Lucky 13, all the way up in seventh place. Hey Patrick, uh, which cars have the leaf battery? That's some Twitch questions out there. Oh, uh, the leaf batteries. We know that. Fubar's got a leaf battery. Fubar, Rizzo Racing's Flavorize has yeah, a leaf battery. Flavorize, I think Lilo and Stitch also has a, uh, a leaf battery. The Waffle it. Cart has a leaf, a leaf battery. Yeah, the Waffle Cart's got a leaf battery. That is one of the technolo technology stories of the year of power racing. How do these leaf batteries perform against other battery chemistries? Are the benefits truly there? I think the benefit of the leaf batteries is that they're just ginormous cells. Oh, what a beautiful oh, no. move by Baltimore Burners. Lightning McQueen is literally living up to a chain right now. <laughs> Unbelievable pace out of Lightning McQueen. Desperately trying to make up the laps it lost. That car is a rocket ship, Patrick. You're going down turn one right now. Look at it stream by. We're clouding collapse into turn one. It got too close. Oh. Like Icarus, too close to the sun. No. Patrick, it was looking, that was clocked at about 25 miles an hour going down in the third one. Oh. Going too far. Poor Mario Kart having a problem getting going. Mario Kart, get a move on. Mario Kart needs a star to get moving. That's a PS1 car. Pumping Station 1 from Chicago. Not looking so great in their Mario Kart. Oh, lots of bumping. I hear a lot of cars scraping walls out there every now and then. Yeah, the walls are getting a lot of attention. They, they used to be straight and they look jagged now. Yeah, they're getting all pulled all sorts of different ways. Being torn asunder. A lot of cars going down the straight. Lightning McQueen was a race leader. Now four laps down. We saw the underside of Fubar for a little bit. Never good when you see the underside of a car. There's so much going on there. Three wide down the back stretch. Three wide, amazing. Absolutely amazing. And the pace going into the front straightaway coming up right here. Oh. Look at the pace that we're seeing out of these, this pack of cars just screaming down. 
Lightning McQueen trying to unlap themselves on Fantastic and the orange car there. That is a fast trying to get around. Are you through. greasy? Are you greasy? And six. Just screaming by the ambulance, which, by the way, that is the aristocrats that ambulance there are currently in fifth place. Lilo and Stitch got by it in the last pit stop. Oh, we have a, another incident. Looks like local area. We're good. Don't have to throw a full cross. No, that. that's all hands at the hazard. Yeah, fourth time. Fourth time they've had to do that, unfortunately. Looks like Rev 1 is trying to get going again. Rev 1 barely moving. Rev 1 has been having tricky trouble all weekend, but it is still going strong. Pokeball slowly moving across, trying to find some Pokemon around here in the track here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do see a Pikachu out there, the Mark III car from the awesome Grace Lake Garage, the sister car to Cartesco. Patrick, do you think the Pikachu car disappears and that Pokeball hits it? I think so. You gotta catch them all out here on the track. The blue stair car, there's always money in Moxie. That's Miller. Get your Moxie boats in, guys. There's a board going around. All these cars out here need moxie boats, so all the cars that aren't doing so great, go ahead and get boats on the moxie board. All those boats turn into race points, vote for as many cars and as often as you like. It's Chicago style voting here at the Power Racing Series. Get those boats in, you can influence the race winner. That's right. This is a voted. This is a voted for racing series. Now remember. For those of you on Twitch, we'd like to know if you guys would want to vote at some point for New York. We've set up a way for you to vote for these cars. Go ahead and type one if you think you should get some votes. Uh-oh, that's Lilo and Stitch, I think, having a problem. No, they're not, there they go. Patrick, you think it'd be good if we had a uh, Twitch play power racing? Place, oh, thank God, it's just trying to... Oh, Lightning McQueen, where are you going, Lightning McQueen? Whoa, what? Attack, what are you doing? What are you doing? What? That way! How do we get spun around again into turn one? Thank God, Lightning McQueen, this is why you're not winning. The Ford GT car just coming by in the front straight. That is a, that is a young team, that is a team made by a very, very bright young man. Currently in 24th place, but the car has a wooden chassis, and it holds together really well. 90 seconds to driver change, 90 seconds to driver change. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, ref one. See, see the stall right there at the start finish line, but they're moving again. No, they got to move it now. Huge to the field right there, the turn one. Just covering with cars. So many to keep track of. Who are in the mix of it? That, that green pickup truck trying to fight. Still stuck in second place. Patrick, I've seen cars coming in the pit early because of how crazy pits become when the mandatory pit stop comes in. There are already right. five cars that pulled it's in as early. Get the driver change. You know, pitting early doesn't help. Everyone has to pit in one minute. That's a little early, Patrick. You pull in and pull out now, it doesn't count. And remember, it cries, no passing under caution. We're going to have to keep those grim penalties going if they pass under caution like that. There are certain areas of the track that need people to slow down and remove the cars. But with so many cars on the track, it's intense. It is. It's absolutely ridiculous. Patrick, I think it's... Go. Ten seconds to driver change. Ten seconds to driver change. Patrick, it's unanimous. Twitch wants to play coach. Wants to not to play Pokemon, it wants to play power racing. That's ridiculous. Alright, we're gonna have to get that set up for you. <laughs> Mandatory driver change. Everybody pull into the pits, change your drivers, Here we go, change Patrick. your batteries, change your motors, change your underpants, whatever it is. I'd like the camera fo folks, uh, those wonderful people out there, Cartastri, the orange car, and then Blue Ball Labs, your second place car right now. So camera one. Go ahead and take Cartastrophe. He's already on its way out, so Fubar Labs is still in the pits. Another superior move by Cartastrophe. Patrick, I did not expect this. I expected Cartastrophe to need a faster car with the worst pit strategy, but they have both now. The faster car and the better pit strategy. 
Rhubar Labs does not have an answer to it. We got a bunch of cars that were in and out. Now back out on track, Cartastrophe, definitely a faster pit stop. Look at him go out. Here they got almost got a green track out there. But now here they all come filing out. Welcome 13, we have got seventh place making up spots because of that Are You Greasy in sixth place. Lilo and Stitch is holding on to fifth. An early pit stop really benefited her. She was able to get back out on the track. Cartas to be barely hanging on. Kubar trying to claw their way up back to first. Lightning McQueen. Macho Man taking his time to piss. The Aristocrats taking his time to piss too, actually. That might be bad for the Randulance Patrick that's in fourth place. Yeah, Randulance trying to come back out right behind the uh, train wreck. Randulance is now battling Lightning McQueen. But not with pit stops like that. It won't get podium at this rate. It has to have a better stop. I think the aristocrats and ambulance is counting on Baltimore Burners for burning now. I think they're counting on it. I, 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 I believe that's their prediction for the race. Otherwise, I, I can't explain the gingerly pace that they have in the pit stops right now. It seems very early on for that. There, there are three laps down to build the lightning the clean. Running wide there through turn two. It's getting really tight. Good God. Yeah, Randolph has four laps to Lightning McQueen. A mechanical failure will put Randolph near there. But aside from the pit times, it comes down to it. Really. Oh no! The rusty racers have lost the. They've lost tire pressure. Oh, there's a flat coming on that. Yes, that's right. That's exactly what the Randolph wants. Huh? is out. We're gonna have to push him off. Pushing it off the track. There we go. All right, green flag again. <laughs> Patrick, what a benefit for Baltimore Burners getting that flat just when that caution popped out. Are they still going? Are they under lower pressure? I can't tell from here. Seems to be even more debris in that section of the course. Now there's bits of cars all over in turn one. There's so much carnage on the track. I can't tell if they're mechanical parts or just body parts. To my best knowledge, the, the banana car is definitely an RU Gracie's in the back slowing up too. Jeez, it's hard. It's oh, hard. yeah, well, and one of the cars is getting pushed off. Underway there. And there's bits of foam all around turn one. I think it's some of these body parts. Yeah, there's parts all over the course. It's, it's looking a little Mad Max out there right, right now. Right now, the blue banana car, the stair car, banana's not driving it right now, was. That is your Moxie leader right now. Remember, there's always Moxie in the grandstand. That's right. Get those boxing folks in. In fact, we got we got three Mad Max uh, themed cars. We have the Mad Max, we have Xanax Max, and Lucky 13 is also a Mad Max. Oh, and the Atomic TV into turn two, right into the wall. Huh? With Are You Greasy and All Hands After, three cars, two separate incidents. Oh no. Huh? Huh? Oh, he's having a 
to take a selfie with the fail rail. Yeah, that's right. It's a penalty for passing under caution. Passing under caution is a selfie with the fail rail. Yes, the fail rail is fully inflated and failing. failing. And Baltimore Burns had to take a selfie with that. Let's knock out. But Lightning McQueen, three laps down the hall might be four. Oh, we got another caution. No, no, never mind. <laughs> oh, it's it's a Mad the Xanax Max, another Mad Max car. It's got something yeah. wrong with it under the hood. Patrick, I have to say, it is really hard to cover this race. Every corner has something happening in it. We've never had this many cars in the Power Racing Series. This is 36 cars on the same track at the same time. And it is massive hysteria. It is just everywhere. Every corner there's a battle. Every turn there's a wheel falling off. We're trying to get you the best of everything. But as you can imagine, the small crew that we have, we're doing what we can. And the ambulance, signing off his horn, sounding it off even. The ambulance trying to, I do believe the ambulance oh, 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 is caution. Huh? Oh, the Pokeball has hit Hippie Rose. Oh, Hippie Rose really got together that's with that. That's not how you catch a Pokemon, that's how you catch uh, a, a venereal disease. <laughs> <laughs> what? No? All right, Johnny Carson. Anyway, the Pokeball is just completely stuck in there. That's a for all, for wrong caution. Back underway. And now the field is all bunched up, which means probably more cautions. Track marshal Green, be aware. You've got to get the cars undone. So looking at the front of the field, looks like Mickey Rose is back underway. Kartashvi's still your leader. Let's go a little bit into the field. I'm going to try to read off what we got. Tom Cheney in 11th, Walker Carton 12th, Starfleet 13th, Lego Car 14th place. The Rainbow Roadsters in 15th, the Blue Steer Car is moving for 22nd oh. to 16th place. Oh, and the leader, the leader in the Casey Car has collided now. One mistake by Kartashvi. Benefits three more laps. Move our in that green pickup truck. All right, Patrick. I have an interview with Macho Man Randy Savage. What does Macho Man Randy Savage have to say? What does Macho Man have to say? Our drivers have lost their minds, ladies and gentlemen. The heat, the tiny cars. Who knows what happens to them at this point? Oh, another caution! Huh? Turn two to oh, and it's Lilo and Stitch! Oh no! Lilo and Stitch in fifth huh? place! Huh? They're gonna lose spots to that. That's a fifth place right now. Are you Greasy's gonna overtake them soon? The Greasy Grease truck.